That damn van is amazing. I don't know, guys. I think a couple of the cars got to go. This, all, this is enough for y'all to see right here. Just this piece right here. Here's your boy Stunner Reach Man. Vibe out with me. Right. Exquisite mix. Let's go. I want to leave you here. We can run together. Listen, if we run together, they will shoot us from behind. We both die. So, of course, what you hear? They will kill you. No, they don't worry about me. I'm all of them. 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 I'm all It's your boy Stunner and I'm back, 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 back with another video, man. Hold on, hold on, hold on, man. We got to do something, man, right now before I even go any further in this video, man. We got to do something immediately, guys. Video, I have to pause, man. Hold on. Yeah, sir, we had to hit that remote start on Vino, man. We could not, <laughs> could not, not, not do that. It is freezing out here, y'all, in Chicago, man. So, yeah, I just made it back to Chicago yesterday, guys. And, uh, man, we got a lot of stuff going on, got a lot of stuff to do. Man, we gonna try to get y'all the best content I possibly can while I'm here in Chicago. I'm gonna be here for approximately about three weeks probably going to be taking off to go to Miami around the 10th to the 12th, you know, range. And, um, man, you know what I'm saying, of January. So we just got to, you know what I'm saying, keep everything popping off until then. But in the meantime, in between time, y'all know I got a lot of stuff going on. We got stuff going on with Sosa, hopefully. Sosa, we'll be hearing some stuff about Sosa soon, getting Sosa back. Also, y'all already know that we got... Roseanne giveaway is live, guys. I haven't been able to show y'all Roseanne in so long, man. Roseanne just been in the garage chilling all the whole time. I've been in Texas and in Houston and in what Beham, Nashville, Tennessee. Yeah, Roseanne just been here laying low, man, ready for the new person to pick this car up i can't wait to see who gets it guys we definitely gonna uh, try to pull it out you know a couple times uh, just for some little little enjoyment before it goes uh, as y'all can see man we got snow here in chicago yeah and guys i'm not feeling it man listen came home everybody's sick nobody's feeling good it's just bad bad situation and scenario guys and um guys i i, I feel like you know i gotta do something different man i can't can't spend the rest of my life cooped up in a place where it's uh snowing all the time and you can't really do nothing people don't really want to come out people don't definitely don't want to bring the cars out or none of that you know so definitely want to you know make a move man i ain't gonna lie uh, i know people been commenting on lady x's videos some crazy stuff man it just it's just be crazy man make sure y'all go and subscribe to lady x too man she uh definitely back on her grind man salute to her you know uh you can find her youtube channel in the description of this video and all my videos i'm posting but yeah um but Right now, man, I'm about to try to run to the post office 
and go see we got some packages and stuff that should be on the way that i haven't gotten yet we also got some packages in the house that i already got and we're gonna be talking about that stuff also um you know this video is just gonna be a lot of pretty much information guys it ain't too much i could do as far as on the car side we might take uh roseanne for a little quick cruise around the block or something you know what i'm saying nothing too crazy but might take take her on out man she uh definitely deserve it i haven't got a chance to, to drive it at all pretty much i got it and then took right off to go out of town so yeah I mean, I haven't even got a chance to enjoy this car. Somebody gonna get a nice ass car. This car looks so damn good and it's different, y'all. Super different than any other G Body out there on the road. Yeah. Alright, well I gotta put my garbage cans up and then we're gonna hop in Vino and get up out of here. So I'll holler at y'all in a second. Let's go. Alright, gang, 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 gang. Boy starting got the garbage cans put up, man, and uh Ooh, I gotta say one thing, man. Thank you guys so much for letting your boy Stunneries hit 97K, man. All y'all who went and hit that subscribe button. Shout out to my brother CG on 32s. I know he had asked a lot of the 32 gang to come over here, and I appreciate y'all so much, man. Also, all my real ones, Stunner Squad, y'all already know I'm rocking with y'all to the death. It ain't gonna never change, man. Ain't never gonna switch up, man. Appreciate y'all so much. Oh, man, it's just. Guys, we are less than 3,000 subscribers away from hitting that 100K gang. And y'all already know, man. It's just something that I've been, you know, wanting to do for a long, long time. Been talking about it for years. And uh, it seems like 2023 might be the year. So, we'll see. But we got to get up out of here before my van cut off. Uh, uh, I made it, y'all. Okay. Vino's still looking good though. I polished the hell out of Vino, boy. Yeah. Polished the hell out of Vino. Still looking good. Big Vino, man. That damn van is amazing. Do so much stuff right. <laughs> I'll tell you. Vino is a beast. Definitely got to get the oil change and stuff on it before I go on my next tour. Oh, jeez. Talked to my brother, Big John, the other day. And, uh, he was telling me he's going to get him some new forgies for his drop vert. His vert. He got a 73, my favorite body style dunk. Uh, and he's going to do them. The big cap wire wheels from Forgiatos. Yeah. Uh, I think I showed y'all his car before. I think if y'all had to go back then, I can't remember which video, but yeah. I think I showed this car before. That's a badass car. He got it's almost the exact color as Nava's car. Maybe just a tad shade lighter, but he didn't do gold. He did all chrome, so uh, it's nice, nice white interior but yeah can't wait to see see that done y'all know man your boy just i am, feel like i'm out of my element now <laughs> uh my body has definitely decided that warmer climates is where it should have been my whole entire life man look at my damn arizona ic i left in it's frozen it's a frozen Arizona iced tea, man. It ain't even, can't even drink it no more. It's frozen, man. Everything here is frozen. Like, Vino is like probably even mad at me right now. It's like, you mother, why would you bring me up? Yeah, Drac, like, you miss, man. You done left me up here, took Kavari. Yeah, all my cars is probably mad at Kavari right now and Vino. And Kavari probably mad at me, like, bruh. You took me from that to this. Like, man, look, I, I can't even explain it, y'all. Like, this is a whole nother level cold. And I've been in Chicago my whole life, y'all. But, and it ain't even the worst of it. Like, they say it's about to get negative degrees and all that types of stuff, man. Like, gosh, y'all just don't even understand, man. Wow. 
they still hold their car meets in Texas. Yeah, people in Texas still able to live, still able to move around, still able to, you know what I'm saying, live their lives and stuff like that. But here, yeah, we gotta go through a thing thing. We living in the Iraq. Yep. But yeah, it is what it is, man. But yeah, gang, uh, I'm about to head to the post office and then we're gonna see what we see when we see it, man. So y'all just stick around for this whole entire video. Hopefully we got something I can uh, show you guys there. And then also, um, I got some packages I'm gonna show y'all when I get home that I already picked up, but I was expecting some more stuff too. So it's like, uh, ooh, look at my boy Alex truck. I don't know if y'all heard me the other day in uh, the video where I talked about my brother's girl losing her life, but I had also told y'all that Alex had crashed his truck and uh, yeah, I just seen it. But yeah, gang, that's what it is. But uh, like I said, hopefully uh, we got some new packages here to show y'all and uh, we gonna talk about some things too and some upcoming things that we are gonna be, you know what I'm saying? be doing so yeah it is what it is man y'all just stick around i'll let y'all a minute man let's get to the post office all right let's go three hours later all right gang 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 man guys this is ridiculous man i've made it over to the other property uh i didn't have any mail in the p.o box that i was expecting still gets his on his way um, but you know, I just gotta wait till like, it actually comes in, man. But guys, man, I just got a whole lot of thinking going on, man. I'm gonna have to make some tough, tough decisions, y'all. <sighs> y'all see, we in the garage with drag, <laughs> drag, drag. Yeah. Also. We got a hollow point right here, man. Big hollow point. I ain't seen hollow point in a minute. Red gang, red, red, all red gang. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, man, on my way over here, guys, I'm thinking about so much stuff, guys. And, um, man, guys, I, I ain't gonna lie, man. I, I think this is gonna be my last winter here in Chicago. God say the same. Um, I love my cars. I love my toys and other things, but I love being able to feel free more than, you know, any materialistic stuff to keep it a hundred. So, um, you know, being able to be free is just a whole different way of living, you know. You know, being here in Chicago, this stuff has to stay put up, man, all went along. So, it's like, <laughs> you're not even getting to enjoy it. I got three cars sitting right here, plus I got Roseanne at the other house, and I still got Sosa out. So, yeah can't enjoy any of that stuff right now because it's just so damn cold and just damn snow you know what I'm saying it's just ridiculous so like I said man I got some tough decisions to make man I don't know guys I think a couple of the cars gotta go um I don't, I don't really want to do it but if it come between me getting a place somewhere warmer and being able to live, you know, year round. And I'll still have, you know, say a place here in Chicago versus, you know, being in this situation. It's, uh, I think it's going to come down to the better decision would be me to relocate and, uh, you know, try to get somewhere. So establish where, you know what I'm saying, be a little bit warmer. And uh, I could just enjoy my life a little bit more. Uh, also, man, my daughter, my son, uh, the kids, 
Lady X, they all been sick, man. Like, and I know it's the weather, you know. And I'm hoping that they've been eating right and stuff. And I'm, I keep talking to them and, you know, trying to tell them, you know, make sure you're eating right. Make sure you're taking your proper vitamins and stuff like that. Because that's all just as important as the weather. You know what I'm saying? You got to take care of yourself. You got to build your immune system up. Taking that vitamin D and that zinc every day is very important. So, you know, I'm hoping they're doing the right things right in reference to that. But, yeah. So, guys... First and foremost, I'm going to have to start looking for a place on wherever I decide to end up going or relocating to, whether that's going to be, you know, Texas or Florida. Those are really the only two states that I really, really, really are interested in in going. Uh, I know a whole lot more about Texas because I spend... A lot of time there, y'all, because I got a lot of friends there. I got Demonology there. I got, you know, Hemi Life 44, CJ, Marty Marby there a lot, uh, Rail to Rail, uh, Audio Cat, 728, uh, Chris NYC, you know, and many, many more people, you know what I'm saying, that I like really, really, truly rock with, for real, for real, that live there. So that would be an easy choice, easy move. Uh, as far as Miami, definitely my favorite place. But I, I don't have as many, you know, contacts, as many hookups and stuff there. And when I'm going the next month, I'm definitely going to try to start, you know, making more contacts and more things like that um, so that I can get tapped in with the culture a little bit more and rubbing more elbows, networking and stuff like that. So, yeah, guys, that's really, you know, my two places that I'm really considering moving to is either Florida or Texas, you know. Um now, the thing is, am I going to be able to facilitate a place that's going to hold four or five cars? You know, it's a lot easier to find a place with a two-car garage, which would be probably Kavari and Drac, Kavari and Drac, versus trying to find a car, uh, you know, three, four-car garage that's going to facilitate Drac, Hollow Point, Kavari. Salsa. Then I got, of course, my trailer, which is the carriage and Vino to die. So, it's going to be tough. I ain't going to lie. It's going to be tough. You know, and then, you know, trying to move and then have all these different storages and stuff like that. Um, if I was to try to keep the car, you know, you got to have all these different storages and things like that to facilitate, you know, send the cars so that, you know, they just ain't out in the sun getting beat you know what I'm saying all year long or whatever but even if I did relocate to Texas guys I ain't gonna lie I'm gonna still be doing my, all my traveling or if I still move to Miami I'm gonna still be doing all my traveling but it, it'll just be a place where if I'm there I'm not forced to travel I'm not forced to you know have to go and you know be on tour all the time you know I do like and I enjoy being on tour I ain't gonna lie but I don't, I don't want it to be a forced thing. And then the thing of it is also um, my, my daughter being sick and the kids being sick and stuff. I don't want them to have to deal with that all the time either. So it's just a, it's just a tough decision. It's just a tough time in my life, guys. And, I, I you know, I enjoy doing YouTube or whatever. But there's nothing that I can do about the weather here. There's absolutely nothing I could do. And people uh, make comments and stuff. Oh, you want to be on the road. You want to be doing this. You want to be doing this. Now, the reason I'm on the road and doing the things that I do is to build for the future at the end of the day. Seriously. Seriously. Um, I, I love it. It's my life. I've been into cars since I was a little bitty kid. You know what I'm saying? And um, ain't nothing going to change about that. You know, it's just just what I love, but I, um, I want, I want better for my family at the end of the day. So I'm making the sacrifices and stuff like that. People in Lady X comments saying a lot of stupid stuff on, on the video she be posting. And that's cool. It's cool. I have no problem with it. And, you know, everybody's entitled to their own opinion about everything, you know, <laughs> they, they say, oh, you out making, you know, you out being out in Texas when you could be sitting at home with 
Lady X and the kids. Well, being out in Texas making content is what is bringing people to get to, you know, the channel and making people watch and view the channel and stuff like that, which in turn makes money and things like that. Makes me build more connections, more contacts and things like that. So there's a lot of other things that come. It's not just about me being out on the road. If I was just to sit at the in the house all day with Lady X and the kids, that's not what my audience wants to see. I don't have, I'm not CJ So Cool. I'm not trying to be CJ So Cool. I'm not CJ So Smooth. I'm not Funny Mike. I'm not, I'm Stunner Reese. You know what I'm saying? And I can only entertain y'all and show y'all the things that I'm interested in organically. You know what I'm saying? So if, if I do some family stuff on my channel, yeah, I'm going to do some family stuff on my channel. Like this Thursday, we got something planned out that we're going to be doing. Uh, it's going to be real nice, real fun. And it's going to be different. You know what I'm saying? But I can't just do that all, all the time and, you know, keep my channel growing and keep myself, you know, on the road to that 100K gang that I'm trying to get to. And once again, I appreciate that 97K from y'all, man. It means a lot. It means a lot. I appreciate it, man. We, we you know, we growing slow, but hey, slow is better than no. Trust me. But yeah, that's what it is, man. Um, but... I mean, a lot of people don't understand, you know, with YouTube, it's a sacrifice. A lot of things sacrifice. A lot of things going behind the scenes that y'all have no idea of what's going on. Y'all only get the 30 to 40 minutes that, you know, I get an opportunity to share with y'all on a daily. And I can't cram my whole entire life into those 30 or 40 minutes. It just ain't going to happen, you know, so... I just like to, you know, keep it real with y'all, keep it a hundred with y'all, and uh, yeah, guys, that's one of the decisions that I'm, you know, I'm really, really uh, working on. You know, uh, I'm, it's gonna start sooner than later. I'm, I'm gonna really, you know, just take a look at the um, cost of living in both places. Of course, uh, Dallas, Texas, is a lot less expensive to live than in Miami. Also, the thing with Miami. Um, and I, I love Miami, y'all. Like, that's as far as places to be, I love Miami. But as far as me, I don't have all the resources and all the connections to, um, you know, all the car shows and stuff that I do in Dallas. So that is something that I definitely got to work on. The other thing about Miami that's tough is they don't have as many houses on the market that I've seen that has garages the same way because the garage pretty much is going to be mandatory. I ain't no way I'm going to be leaving Drac outside or Kavari just sitting outside like if I actually own a place there. No, they're going to they're gonna be in the garage. So that's what it is. Um, but you never know, man, what, what, what end up happening. You know, oh shit, I might have to get rid of even Kavari, you know, it could happen, you know, for me to make the move. Because if it came down to it where I could only, you know, find something that's, you know, one car garage or whatever, then, you know, Drac definitely going in the garage. <laughs> Kavari, you outside, so I might just get rid of Kavari. I don't know, guys. I don't know, man. That's, that's so much stuff playing through my head, guys. Y'all, Y'all just don't understand, you know costs a lot to uh, fuel uh, all these cars and insure all these cars and then fuel for Vino traveling up and down the highway and then, you know, um, car payments, <laughs> you know. Kavari ain't free. Vino ain't free. Everything else is paid for. Everything else is paid for. We got the title to everything else, but yeah. So, you know, it is what it is, man. It is what it is. I just, you know, got to make the right decision at the end of the day. But what would y'all do? Tell me, what would y'all do? You know, would y'all stay here and deal with this? You know, and uh, I mean, it's going to be like this, guys, until April and it's December. You know, it's gonna, I mean, as far as the snow, maybe even 
you know and then no car content is going to start coming out of Chicago until June cuz ain't nobody doing no car car shows or nothing really in in May here so June is when you're going to start seeing people so that's literally 6 months from now it's December right now it's the middle of December so yeah we got a long time and you don't have that problem in Miami you don't have that problem in Dallas you know they got actually it's crazy it's a car meet going on right now in Dallas right now uh, Monday Night Mayhem with, with my with my homies my little homies y'all seen them on a video I think a couple days ago I had them on video a few days ago I had them on a video yeah so yeah but they don't they're not dealing with this so what do we do y'all what do we do how do we make this whole thing work how do we make this work? I know I want to enjoy my cars. I want to enjoy Drac. I want to enjoy Kavari. I want to enjoy Hollow Point. Somebody else is about to enjoy Roseanne. Yeah, if y'all haven't got uh, y'all entries in, man, for Roseanne, guys, it is literally less than 50 people have entered that giveaway, that fundraiser giveaway to win. Uh, Roseanne, guys. I'm going to be giving it away to somebody also. I'm going to be giving away some cash and everything, guys. So, y'all definitely, man, maybe make sure y'all click the link in the description of this video and get y'all Roseanne entries in right now. All right? Do that. Because uh, somebody's going to be a big, big blessing. Big, big blessing. But, guys, let me tell y'all some of the things that we're going to be doing uh, while I'm here for this uh, approximately three weeks. Uh, we're going to be ordering the headlights for Hollow Point. Also, we're going to be replacing that starter. I got to try to see if I can get somebody to replace that starter on there. I want to, you know, I don't want to have to deal with the, you know, it not catching on the Bendex or whatever, um, or the Bendex engaging, whatever is causing it not to, you know, turn over all the way and hold the start while I'm cranking it up. I got to uh, take care of that situation and scenario. So we're going to be taking care of that as well. Also, with Drac, man, we got something very, very special uh, that's going to be happening with Drac. Uh, I'm going to be trying to get my suspension put on while I'm here. If I don't get an opportunity to get Jordan to do that, that, you know, that might not be happening. But, man, I'm going to tell y'all something. I'm going I'm to I'm 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 go ahead and tell y'all, man. I'm going to go ahead and tell y'all. We got a new center console. That's going to be built for Drac. Yeah, we're going to do something a little bit more modern. Still tasteful. Still, like, functional like this. But we're going to do something a little different for the console, guys. So we're going to be bringing y'all some heat with a new console for Drac, man. Just something a little bit more modern, man. We're going we're gonna to figure it out. It's going to be dope, whatever it is. Trust me, though. Trust me. Uh, yeah, so can't wait to see. To get that going that's gonna be exciting uh haven't had no interior stuff done and track in so long but yeah that's gonna be something new and refreshing i can't wait to see what we come up with as far as on the center console i'm gonna introduce y'all to the guy who's gonna be doing it and everything um when we get an opportunity to go illegal with him i gotta try to actually get up with him like brother sooner than later because he only got three weeks to get it done basically and um, yeah, so so those are two things that we got coming, uh, two cars that we got some stuff coming with. And also, I just talked to Playboy today. Playboy said that he will start working on Sosa. He got everything in for uh, Sosa to get it done. And uh, he's going to start working on it after Christmas. So it'll be done hopefully before the new year. So, you know, we're going to be having Sosa sitting perfectly hopefully very very soon i know y'all can't wait for that but yeah gang that's what it is so yep 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 but yeah man i just want to come over here and chop it up with y'all in reference to that uh still uh when i get home i'm gonna show y'all what i got packages wise and oh yeah i got something else at home that's for drac too man i can't wait to show y'all that too yeah it's a super super legendary Thing about to happen with Drac. Check it out, man. Y'all is not going to believe it. It's going to be nasty, too. I can't wait to show y'all.
Yep. All right, gang. But uh, yeah. So y'all just stick around. The video ain't over. Just had to come over here and holler at y'all for a little while. It's your boy. Let's get it. Yeah. One hour later. All right, gang, 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 man. Your boy is finally back. Every squizzy pad, man. And I got something I want to unbox for you guys today, man. And uh, I'm not going to do the whole reveal of it because I got to do that actually for the company. But I just want to let y'all know I'm going to open it up and show y'all what it is. But I'm not going to actually open the package. But from me doing what I'm doing, you guys should get the gist of what's about to go down. Now, this application is actually for drag. That's right, man. This is something that could have been updated a long, long time ago, but I never did because I never really was into this. But when the opportunity came and they said, hey, we want to work with you on drag, I was like, here we go, man. This is something that I think is going to be pretty dope. Man. So what we got here, yes, sir. I think a lot of y'all gonna like this. And like I said, I'm gonna do the full install review video and everything on it. But yeah, what we got is N Dash Entertainment System uh, Radio for Drag, man. With my good people over at I Hope. That's right, man. A T O T Atoto. Okay. <laughs> Atoto. So yes, gang, this is gonna be a super dope uh, thing that we're gonna be adding to drag. I can't wait to get it installed. I gotta call my brother over at Basehead Customs Reggie. I'm gonna let him do the install on this because uh, I know he got everything in stock to do it. No, we ain't got to be running back and forth, this, that, and other. It's just going to be a clean, simple install. We're going to bring Drac over to his shop. I got to call him in the morning and set up an appointment. So this is one of the surprises that I've been holding out on to tell y'all about until I got back here because I knew it was here. So um, this is actually the second time that they shipped this out. They actually tried to ship it to my P.O. box using ups and ups does not i repeat does not ship to p.o boxes so if you guys ever want to ship me something never ever ever use ups to ship me something to a p.o box <clears throat> so yeah but i'm gonna just give y'all a sneak peek because i i can't i can't not give y'all a sneak peek because uh, i'm i'm Definitely excited about this. Oh yeah. This all this is enough for y'all to see right here. Just this piece right here. Yes, sir. Got a nice size screen. That's gotta be like almost a 12-inch screen going inside a track. Yeah, that's gonna be dope. Definitely dope, man. So shout out to my good people over Atato <laughs> who provided this. So I'm gonna put it back in the box cause I gotta actually do a whole full unboxing video on this product once we about to get it installed. So yeah. I know y'all couldn't see me, but yeah, I gotta actually do a whole unboxing video on this product when we are about to get it installed so that you guys can get the whole effervescence of the whole install. Yeah, from right now, we just gonna set it back in there. Just like it came. Trying to get my baby upstairs coughing. She been having a rough time, y'all, with this uh, illness she got going on. Oh, I got it backwards. That's why I didn't want to go. I just turned it around. Maybe it's. Oh no, I couldn't. I got a chance as well. But yeah, gang. Um, yeah, she's been having a little rough time with her cough. And we just actually ordered up some Dr. Serby's daughter's elderberry and gave it to her today. She actually just coughed up a lot of 
mucus and we're hoping that uh, you know that's going to help them. It's a, a natural remedy and you know we want to try some natural stuff. Yeah, see if they're struggling. All right, gang, but I got to go tend to Millie. Hope y'all enjoyed this video. Love y'all so much. It's your boy Stone Marie signing out. Peace. Today's video is brought to us by the Street Whip Stunting Facebook group. If you're into custom cars, the Big Wheel culture, Big Wheel racing, or anything customized with cars, motorcycles, and trucks, make sure you join the Facebook group street whip stunting you can post all your pictures all your videos and it's free so definitely click the link in the description of this video and join the facebook group street whip stunting hey, hey, hey. Okay, uh, subscribe share uh what does it like for you to get subscribe spread like square oh, yeah. oh, shit <laughs> Subscribe, All right, subscribe, square. Yeah, subscribe, share, and like. It ain't square. It's square. All right, that's Subscribe to my man.